Hey all, Tony Bing here and welcome back to another video for Marvel Strike Force. Now, today we have Shuri Unlocked, which means we can now use the Wakandans to their full potential in raids. So I'll have two videos. I'll have the Ultimus Raid 6, but I still need that to reset. And I'll have the Thanos Raid 3, and that's what we'll cover in this particular video, because I've got a, a lane that my alliance have left for me to run through. So thanks to them for doing that for me. And here we go, really. Let's jump in and, and see how we get on. So we're going up the far right here, it starts off really early, so we'll, we'll very likely smash the first couple of nodes, but it'll still be interesting to see anyway, hopefully. So for this first match, we'll keep it on times one, and then in the later ones, once we've seen all the animations, we'll put it on times two. Now you'll notice I'm missing Killmonger, because unfortunately in this raid you have hero-only nodes, you also have villain-only nodes, which really won't work for the Wakandans at all, unfortunately, but we can show them off here anyway, and we do have some nodes where you can choose either set up really you can choose the heroes or the villains there we go we're going to get a lot of chains here via black panther there's electra coming back i'm just going to smash her down again let's actually go for the, the ultimate here so we get the two kills we filled the speed bar twice and he dodged can't believe that happened you kidding me electra come on will it happen again no, it didn't, okay. So next up here, let's see. Once Black Panther gets going, really, no one stands a chance. There we go, somebody else is getting another turn now, so we've got Shuri. So let's see this here. So you can see all the charges, all the energy flying out. Defense up, immunity, deflect. And we'll see. Ah, let's see, we've got heal block on in Baku. He actually resisted it. That's really nice. And we've been stripped there of our buffs, unfortunately. Let's now go for the ultimate here. He should cast it again because he got the kill on it. I believe that's how it works. That's nice. And we're going to miss here, so we'll just use the basic... Let's go for the fence up. Let's him down. Going a little bit slow here, but it's because I only have four characters, because I purposely didn't put in a fifth character that wasn't a Wakandan member. Now, the clock's ticking down. Let's actually put it on times two. Let's see in a moment. You should see him back out healing up if he actually needs it. I'm not sure he will though. We don't need the healing here at all. Yeah, you can see that very small heal there. So the way it works with Mbaku in raids is when he has the charges of someone attacks him and he can gain charges by actually taunting up, then you're you're forcing someone to attack him. And because he's got such a high chance to actually block the damage, you'll probably heal for more than they do. So you're you're forcing an enemy to, in a very roundabout way, actually heal you. But that's the first node, so let's jump into the next one. This next node, once again, is hero only, so no killmonger. Pretty easy enemies as well, so I'll try and blast through it as quickly as I can here. Now uh, let's go for shield security. There we go, we're getting the kill on Panther, so Panther's about to get his time once more. Will he get the kill here? Yeah, he did. Let's go for this. What an absolute beast. Really is. No one else is actually getting a look in, to be honest. So we'll go for Hawkeye this time. There we go, the chain's broken at last. Oh no, it's not, he's got another turn. He's actually got a few turns when I think about it due to that ultimate. This is a Black Panther show. This is unbelievable. Here's the ultimate background again. This is crazy. I'm not getting to see anything else. And the assists as well. So, looks like the way it works is if a Koi gets the kill assist, the same way it works with, let's see, it would be Miss Marvel, then it does generate the speed bar for him. Look at that. 
Wow. <laughs> right, let's check out the next node. So it's another hero only node, but the next one you can choose any character so we can thankfully bring in Killmonger at last and see how that works out. But for here, let's see if we can take down Electra before she stealths up. There we go, I'm kind of glad I didn't get the kill there, <laughs> just so our characters can get a shot as well. So we've got the defence up, it's procking everything on them. You can see the Black Panther's charging as well there in his, his suit. So that's nice. And then we'll go for... Let's actually go for Quake here. So the assists on Okoye are nice. As much as she's disappointing, I did think that in the full Wakandan team she would certainly be a lot better and that looks to be the case. Especially the combination between Panther and Okoye with the, the speed bar on kill. So next we'll go for Shield Trooper. And we'll go for the ultimate here because it is charged up. I really like this, the way you can charge him up without his health having to drop down. I wasn't aware that's how it would work. But that's really nice. And all the energy going to him so he can get his ultimate up quicker again. And here's the assist. Wow. Absolutely amazing. Right, let's check out the full Wakandan team as if that wasn't good enough so far. Alright, now it's time to, to really go to town on them. So we'll go for Shield Trooper. Hopefully take him out here. Yeah, there we go. Don't need the heal at all, so applying the heal block, not that we really need it at all. And then let's see, we'll go for the special. So we're really not lacking when it comes to damage, but dropping Killmonger into the mix as well, and he's really nice from a damage perspective, and his drain is really pretty powerful. It's going to be crazy. Let's take out this one here. Go for the trooper next. And so the chain begins. <laughs> or it'll probably stop here, in fact. Trooper with defence up. You don't need healing at all. Let's go for the chain here. Hopefully we get a crit. No, no crit from all those moves there. Now, next we'll go for the optive. And then we can hopefully, yeah, we can still get Winter Soldier in time. Let's cap down as well with the chain. Got all the stacks of a fence up as well. Two stacks of it. Let's go for this here. And we should take out Iron Man. Yeah, that's him down. Unbelievable. <laughs> Absolutely amazing. This is pretty easy at the moment. I'm working my way through the nodes. Like Ultima 6 will be the better test, but this is still good to see. There we go. Okay, we've got one final node we can do now. We're back to heroes only, unfortunately. For this final node here then, we've got a jacked up Hulk that we will eventually be going up against. That should be interesting to see because looking at his changes that he's had on paper, they don't look that strong. But when I've been up against him, he's actually been pretty difficult. Although against the Wakandan team, I do have an idea that we're probably just going to smash him, to be honest. Now, looking at the skills to cast here, we'll put the, the heal block on Drax anyway. That way if he uses any of his skills and he's got the drain, it's not going to apply there. And then let's see. From here, let's actually try and take out this fabricator over here. We've got a fence up, so there we go. That's them down. And then we'll be getting some chains here on Black Panther once again. MVP of this video, without a doubt. So there we go. We've got the assist there, and once again, that fills up Panther speed bar. Combo the two of them really is pretty amazing. I was thinking for a while of actually dropping Okoye, but I don't think that's going to happen. I don't think I could drop any of the other characters when I actually look at them as well. So they've got the 
Wakandan team lock really pretty tight. Now, when are we going to get this Hulk dropping in so we can see how we, we do against them? There we go, he's dropped in now. So we'll go for the ultimate here, get some chains. That was really nice there. We're potentially going to have so many chains here that I'm not even sure if, if Hulk will get much of a go at all. So I'll go for the defense up. We've got the cleanse here. Just a single cleanse, which is a little bit disappointing. It would be nice to see if it cleansed more positive buffs, but I suppose with all this, this she's getting in the fact that cleanses as well, maybe would be a bit too strong. Here we go. We're almost finishing up here. Baku bonking Hulk on the head there with that big club and that's us done. So that was pretty awesome. I really enjoyed that. I do think the Thanos 3 raid's a little bit easier than the Ultimus 6. So I'll look to do a video on Ultimus 6 as soon as I can. But thanks for tuning in for this video. I hope it was fun to watch and I'll see you all again soon.